Alright YouTube, this is my video. I'm going to show uh, what I'm working on with my game. So basically, in response to Jaro Vorbis's and his development team, how they're working on their game, uh, this is basically what I'm working on. This is what he and his team has inspired me to do. Um, so, I'm just going to go and show him what I'm working on. Show him my thanks or something like that, whatever you want to call it. Um, so basically this is my editor where I will edit my maps and stuff. I don't have the real graphics that I want for it yet because my graphics dude is on vacation and he should be back soon and he'll be drawing my tiles for me. Um, basically all my code is right here and stuff like that. Random code, you know, you don't need to know that because it's my code. So I'm going to go ahead and run this. And would you like to make a new map or a previous one? By the way, this is not, I repeat, not in any way user friendly because it's for me and I don't think anybody else is going to want to use this. So it's for me and it just does basic things that it needs to do. And so, but back to that, I'm going to go ahead and load a map that I already made. I'm going to press the enter button. That, I got ahead of myself, sorry. Oh, wait, never mind. No, I didn't. Crap. Room dot map. I'm gonna go ahead and load a map that I've already made, and here it is, my map that I've made. I'm happy about it. Um, very very basic. I can just scroll through different tiles using my mouse wheel. I'll be making new tiles on whenever my graphics good good dude gets here. We'll be making videos about our technical adventures too. But this is just basic stuff that I'm gonna go ahead and introduce. I can lay tiles wherever I want. If I press the F2 button, I can save. So let me go ahead and just show you that. Fence, 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 fence. And I'm going to press the F2 button, and it saves. Save map is what? Let me show you that. Save map is what? And I can save it to whatever I want, so I can make it a brand new map. Just for the hell of it. So I'm going to go ahead and save it as room.map. Wow. Look at that. I'm going to escape out of this. Run it. Load room.map and look it shows me what I have changed I'm going to go ahead and change it back because I don't want a random fence in my walkway so room.map and there we go saved escapage yeah I just said escapage I know it's it's not gay though I've, I swear alright so here's my engine basically what I use to load my images draw my images basic uh collision tiles stuff movements my array that goes through every single tile area and draws a tile where it's needed because it basically goes from a file called dot map which has arrays in it you know random stuff and here's my game <sighs> I'm not that smart of a programmer yet so whatever happens in here is happening here and I'm still trying to figure out because this is my first ever game so I'm still trying to figure out how to get my engine to link with my actual game functions so you have a function called coin and I can't get it to work right now but I will soon so let me go ahead and run the engine for you and oh, got a compile error for some reason sorry I'm going to delete that real quick just for the hell of it. And one more deletion. Hmm. And I am really pissed right now. Hold up. Sorry. Function not found. Go fuck yourself. Alright, sorry. That was really embarrassing. Um, I apologize. So basically, see my little character? I made this character. He sucks. He's supposed to be a mage, but as you can see, not a very good mage. So if I press the left key, he goes left, up, up, down, down, etc., etc. So since these are supposedly supposed to look like walls or pieces of wood, if he walks up, he gets stuck. It's because I programmed it for him to get stuck. But the only other thing to get him unstuck is basically press the opposite key so he can't go into any type of glitch and he has to go down and it does it for all of my walls 
As you can see, he can't he can't do nothing. He he he's done. He can't do nothing unless he presses the exact opposite of the key he was pressing in order to get into that block. It's very basic. I know it sucks, but this is my first game, so bear with me. So he can't do anything there. He's walking, he's walking, he's walking, and he can't do anything there because it's just impossible. I told him not to go anywhere, and basically, let's go ahead and uh, escape out of the game. So yeah, that's basically it. So thank you for watching, and Jaro Vorbis and your development team. Congratulations, you guys are the bomb, and I cannot wait for your game to come out.